thing about KP is to make them the best, I think. If they have a system and are very, very organised, they can make things seem very easy for themselves, but more importantly, very, very easy for the rest of the kitchen. There's nothing worse than going to a sink that's full of pots when you're trying to do other jobs around. If they've got a system and they're very organised, the sink is nearly clear all the time. So I think organisation and system is very, very important. Okay, the best KP in the world, very small, so they wouldn't take up any space in the kitchen for part of the time. They would be very tall, so they could reach the plates on the top shelf and put all the pots and pans away and they'd have eight arms, so they could really speed through the work as fast as they could. Have I ever been a KP? Well, not a KP as such. I've been a chef all my life, but I have washed many, many pots and pans and plates, and it's something we do in our kitchen for the majority of the time, which is why when we do get our KPs in on Friday and Saturday, we do appreciate them very, very much. They're as important a member of the team as anybody else. To have an award for them and a competition, I think it's a wonderful idea, because in some of the bigger places that have three or four KPs that are on all the time, and the amount of work that they have to get through. I think it's very important to be able to recognise them and to be able to give them something to be proud of and work to. So I think it's a very good idea in as much as it would give them some more self-esteem and a reward for the hard job they do in kitchens.